All right, YouTubers. Uh, sorry if you can't hear me very well. It's a continuation of the Glastron uh, SE175. I just now got done um, redoing all the valves. I had to reset the carburetor, reset the timing, reset everything uh, to get this motor back to normal. Um, the book calls for a specific setting of how you set the valves. Don't even listen to the book. What you do, keep your side cover off, or if you can, you know, if you got good judgment, flip your motor over until each one of your valves, as they come up on the intake, and then come up on the exhaust, when they finally drop down, you know they're flat perfect. Then you make your adjustment. I want a half a turn on each one of them valves up top. You should see no more than an eighth of the threads, um, if your motor's like mine, coming out of the top for the preload. The book calls for uh, one full turn. That it's it's way over. You'll lose complete compression. Your motor will start spit firing uh, because it's not closing the valves properly. The preload can only do so much. But uh, I wanted to show everybody how it's running now. Uh, this will be the last video I make of this boat. So if anybody has any questions, feel free to ask, you know ask me questions. You can see all my tools down here from doing the job. Right there's the motor running. You can hear it. No issues. Uh, it's working properly now like it should be. But like I said, anybody has any more questions, uh, once again, this is the Glastron SE175. Um, it's got the Volvo Penta, a 3.0 liter motor in it. It's got the SX Cobra, uh, Outdrive. Uh, excellent combination, I've had it on the lake already. Plenty of power in them Outdrives. But um, anybody has any questions, like I said, feel free to, uh, to send me a message. Thanks, bye.